The Department of Labor and Employment reports that the number of unemployed Filipino youth still accounts for more than half of the Philippines' jobless sector. ADB's diagnostic studies show that it can take up to four years for a high school graduate to find a regular job, and only half of them actually do find wage employment. The other half may uh, be in the informal sector or at home, um, not, uh, not in employment, education or training. Just to also emphasize that uh, the ADB diagnostic study also showed that uh, only 20% of high school graduates find a job within the first year of leaving school. So it's important to focus on shortening that transition from school to work, making it easier for young people to enter into that labor market. Compared to sa hindi nag-undergo ng ganitong training, less ang chances nila na ma-employed compared to those who graduated under the Job Start Training Program. So yung transition mas ma-exe. Job Start is a partnership program of Department of Labor and Employment, Asian Development Bank, and the Government of Canada. Its objective is to raise the youth job placement rate to 80% from the prevailing 60 to 65 percent. At risk youth, 18 to 24 years of age, who are either currently not working or has less than a year of work experience and who are not enrolled in an educational or training program or who have at least completed a high school education, through JobStart's full employment facilitation cycle, will have improved chances of entering the world of work. The program aims to increase the employability of the youth by providing them access to technical and life skills training, workplace experiences through on-the-job trainings, demanded by employers, and by mentoring and tooling them to improve their job searches and outcomes. Our programs are um, learner-centered, which means what's important is what, um, what they take home, not just what we bring in. And so they come out of it um, having gone through some sort of transformative learning. Job Start Philippines program has already reached several milestones after more than a year since it was implemented. Across the four pilot pesos, which include General Trias Cavite, Pampanga, Quezon City, and Taguig. Nakatulong po ang Job Start training namin dahil po sa tulong ng na binigay po nilang list of companies at sa binigay po nilang training na skills, knowledge, attitude, na i-apply po namin siya sa pag-apply ng trabaho. Ngayon po, masaya po kasi na-absorb na po talaga ako ng Burger King. Ngayon po, trabaho ko ngayon. Sa cashier po ako. Nakatagal po ako sa trabaho. Nakasaod naman po ako ng maayos. Nakatulong po talaga siya sa akin. Pagkatapos po ng training sa Job Start, um, marami po akong natutunan kung paano po mag-apply sa trabaho, kung paano po i-present ang sarili, at mas naging confident pa po. As a single mother, malaking tulong yung pagpasok ko dito sa Job Start kasi po, syempre, uh, walang ibang inaasahan yung anak ko kundi ako lang. Na pag aral ko yung anak ko galing sa Job Start mismo po. Mayor Lani Cayetano and the City of Taguig, we're, we're really looking for programs because of the availability of uh, more jobs because of the development of the league. So when the Job Start program came in, it was a great opportunity to be able to find ways to match the disparity of um, what, what our businesses need and the capability of our youth and our unemployed. I am thinking of uh, uh, adding more interested companies in a way of putting them into our package of incentives. Surprisingly, in the Philippines, we have a high unemployment rate among the young people. Yet, it is still very difficult for us to find the right people for our stores. And so far, we were able, the, the young students who started out with the project have now been absorbed as part of our teams. So that is an indication that with the proper training, proper guidance of our team, then they can really be, they can really fit our organization. I was impressed with the uh, quality of our, our applicants. Their skills and their uh, intellectual capacity, they are just really above our 
normal screen. So, yun na aplikante namin from the from outside the walk-in. As it enters its second phase, and soon, the nationwide rollout, we are stepping up our effort to achieve full realization of our goals. That's why kami sa Congress, we're working very hard to institutionalize this and pass this into law so that not only the first district of Davao will be a beneficiary and recipient of the program, but all the cities and municipalities all over the country. Well, I think it has good potential to grow. I think all the partners, it's showing evidence that it's working. And as a result, we would want to see this continue and do, do the best we can to increase the opportunity for young people.